Hey YouTubers, it's Smokin' Sea, Sunshine Anna, for the, uh, let's see, next video today. Okay, as always, these videos are pre-recorded, so just to let you know, it makes no difference whatsoever. Now, this is going to be part 91 in my series of How to Smoke a Cigar. It's going to be, what is a knot in a cigar? Now, we've been talking about, um, in the last couple videos, which you'll see in a couple days, we talked about loose draws and tight draws. What is a knot in a cigar? A knot in a cigar, K-N-O-T, is not a good thing, hence the name, not a good thing, not. A knot in a cigar is basically when they are rolling the cigar in the factory. Keep in mind, all these cigars are hand-rolled, they're not produced by evil machines where, okay, I'm being silly, but the point is, they're hand-rolled, and what happens sometimes is, if you get a roller who is inexperienced or isn't that good, you'll get a knot in the cigar. And usually, more often than not, I keep saying knot, this, the knot is in the uh, head of the cigar, which is the very top part of the cigar. And things you can do about it are you can use certain types of tools, like paper clips and um, special types of rods, like. Um, metal rods to poke through, toothpicks, etc. I don't do that personally when I get a, ba a bad cigar. I just deal with it. Like a tight draw, is not much you can do about it. A loose draw, like I said, you can control. You can control a loose draw. You can be careful, you can suck through or draw through slower so you don't overheat the cherry. But a tight, I mean, I, I mean a knot, you really can't do anything about. Now, if the knot isn't somewhere in the cigar, like near the foot of the cigar, you can just wait out, and eventually you'll burn through that part, and you'll usually hear like a sss, like a crinkling, crackling, and that's when you usually burn through the uh, knot. Unfortunately, because most people are, are impatient, or a lot of people are impatient, they won't have the patience to draw slowly, and more often than not, they will overheat the cigar. And when that happens, by the time you get to the knot, the cigar is mushy and squishy and disgusting. So knots and cigars are something you want to avoid. My only advice of how to avoid them is to try to buy higher quality cigars that come from better quality cigar factories uh, where there's more experienced rollers. Anyway, comment, rate, subscribe if you want to, and bye.